I'm gonna set you down, okay? Okay. And then I'm gonna pick you back up. Yeah. Once I get up here, okay? All right. Sit tight. Two Pottawatomie County deputies being hailed as lifesavers tonight. They say that man that you saw there was on the brink of hypothermia. He went into the water after flipping his kayak. News 9's Clayton Cummins shows us what happened next in a story you'll only see on News 9. Deputies here in Shawnee say river rescues are far too common, many of them ending in fatalities. But this is a story of survival. I got everybody on the way out here trying to get to you, okay? It's 9.30 at night Sunday on the North Canadian River near Shawnee. A neighbor calls 911 hearing 25-year-old Jonathan Baker scream for help. He was more than a mile away. I'm trying to find a way to get to you, Bubba. Deputies say Jonathan fell in the water, then got stuck while fishing in his kayak outside for hours. With temperatures near freezing, Jonathan was on the brink of hypothermia. Go ahead and stand up if you can for me and walk around with me. Walk around and talk to me, man. We got to keep some blood pumping. Knowing a fire truck couldn't scale the terrain, two hard. deputies take immediate action. Ooh. Jumping into knee deep water to Jonathan's rescue. I'm going to set you down, okay? okay. And then I'm going to pick you back up. Yeah. Once I get up here, okay? The deputies carried Jonathan a quarter of a mile back to their patrol cars, driving him to a nearby ambulance. The deputy could have went out there, checked the area said that he didn't hear anything, didn't see anything, and gone back in service. He took that extra step to ensure that he did everything he could to try to locate somebody that was yelling for help. Deputies Wesley Nidell and Chris Harmon are rookies on the force, hired only a year ago. If not for them, family says Jonathan wouldn't have made his daughter's first Christmas. I could never thank them enough, and they went above and beyond their call of duty and I'm very thankful for them. Mom says that Jonathan is doing much better fighting chest congestion right now. The sheriff's office says they'll be nominating both deputies for a statewide life-saving award. Reporting in Shawnee, I'm Clayton Cummins, Oklahoma's own News 9.